Do you feel suffocated by fame ever? I mean, walking out the door for you today is way different than it was 10 years ago. Yeah, I, not really. Now I have an understanding of it. I have a patience with it. Um, and also I get, I get time off from it. I think at first it was really overwhelming and I was like, is this gonna be the rest of my life? But when I'm releasing a movie, it's really heavy and really intense and I just know that that will, it will die down and people really stop caring. Uh, pretty quickly. That's not true. Which is we don't. <laughs> we don't care. And one of you, one of the reasons you are my favorite person to interview, true story, Stop. is because you. Because I'm really, your biggest fan. <laughs> <laughs> yes, exactly. No, shut up. Um, <laughs> but because you let it all hang out, and we love that. That's why your fans connect with you. Is that you? You say what you're thinking. You are not calculated and edited. You don't censor yourself. That can come back and bite you in the ass though, right? Like so yes. sometimes there's backlash associated with things that you say. Does that change the way that you'll sit down and do an interview? Will you think about the way you say things differently? It actually just... can't really. I mean, I I don't really have a choice. Like it it which can be scary sometimes because it's not if it was something I was doing on purpose and when I get got bit by it, I could just be like, "Oh, I'm not going to do that anymore." I don't really have the ability to not to be different. So when it bites me in the ass, it just bites me in the ass. That being said, normally when there's a battle, you know, like the Donald Trump hurricane thing, like I didn't say that. So that was, I, that one didn't stress me out too much because I was like, but I didn't actually say it. So yeah. if I had said it, that would be very stressful. But I was just kind of like, oh, that's not true. But yeah, when I do say something and I want to put my foot in my mouth, you know, that sucks, but you move on. Yeah, you seem like it doesn't, you don't let it bother you. That's pretty amazing. You just let it roll. I got, you got to, I, otherwise I'd be in a foam room. Yeah. And I also don't, I don't Google myself as of like, you know, four days. <laughs> <laughs>